Hey, Collider Video fans, it's time for a trailer reaction. You like trailers, you like reactions, you like us reacting to trailers. Don't talk over it, Mark. But here we are, here, with a, uh, oh, you got some email, Mark. Check that. <laughs> yeah, um, it's, uh, yeah. We are here, Mark. I yes. got pulled out of a writing session. Yeah. To react to first season of Sports Night. Close, Ken. Uh, we are reacting to the Aaron Sorkin directorial debut of Molly's Game. What do you think of that? Is there going to be some walking and talking in this? There's probably going to be some walking and talking because this is Aaron Sorkin, the famous, famous screenwriter of Sports Night. Sports Night. Studio 60 in the Sunset Strip. I like that show. I loved that show. Yeah. Uh, he also did, I believe, something called The West Wing. Oh, a little presidential drama. Presidential yeah, yeah, yeah. drama. But he also wrote The Social Network. Yeah. He wrote one of my favorite movies, The American President. Yeah. Have you seen that movie? Uh, That's a good movie. Yeah, I don't get out much. Um... So why is it significant that he is directing? Well, uh, you know, Aaron Sorkin is likes to talk yeah. sometimes. You can see that with the uh, characters he writes. Yeah. They talk, and they walk, and they talk, and they walk. So, But he was saying that he never was going to direct. Right. But then all of a sudden, a year later, after some comments he made, if I'm, if I'm remembering this correctly, he's directing. This uh -huh. is his directorial debut. So it's kind of exciting for the Aaron Sorkin fans like myself to see, is he just going to go right into the walking and talking and just uh, roll right. camera and or has he got something That's up his sleeve this is the first look all right bradley Whitford's probably in this movie right probably all right this is molly's game not a superhero picture aaron sorkin's directorial debut let's watch it Mark. let's do it ready i am clicking in five four three i'm molly bloom do you know about me jesse idris elba kevin costa michael sarah i'm on board I, oh Okay, I'm so Molly that was a trailer Blue. to the trailer. Do you know about me? I hated it so much. Gambling, gambling's good. Last night and I bought your book. Do you understand that you are charged with operating an illegal gambling business? Yeah, I already you like this. Me on as a client? Why? Because gambling. Jessica Chastain. They go together. They go together. Like, peanut butter jelly? I mean, Chastain's great. I'll follow Chastain into the battle. I love Jessica Chastain and Idris Elba. I mean. You can't get any better. Look at him. That's James, he's, James, that's James Bond. That's James Bond. He's sitting there being all cool. I've changed all the names. And Molly, my weekly poker game is moving to the Cobra Lab. See, and I like poker it. movies. Do you like rounders? Uh, I like John Malkovich's uh, Yeah, the Oreos. His accent. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good movie. Ooh, Michael Sarah looks weird with that hair. Moneyball, few good men. Oh, yeah, few paying. good men. With my yeah. assistant, sorry. Fine. I'm not firing you. I'm just going to stop paying you. You get paid once a week from the game. It doesn't seem fair. You're going to stop paying me because I'm making too much money doing my second job. And if I say no, I'll lose both jobs because it doesn't seem fair. You don't have bargaining power here. You are unimportant. Do you know how many witches were burned in Salem? How many? None. They didn't burn witches. It's a myth. They hanged them. The humiliation uh, had given way to blinding anger at my powerlessness. I wasn't going to wait before I put a plan in place. This is a true story. I'm hosting a game in this suite every Tuesday night. First buy-in, 250000 This is like a That's secret, secret poker game. Yeah. We spent eight years in Hollywood and two years in New York running the world's most exclusive and decadent man cave. Have you seen the other names in your indictment? Come on, Marty, just how deep into the Russian mob were you? Your exposure's Ooh. crazy. You got 2.8 million on the She's street right now. Hand hand with the Russians. You managed to build a multi-million dollar Always the Russians. Always the Russians. Not much more. You're a witch. I'm about to be charged in federal court. Well, nobody's perfect. I love Kevin awesome. Costner, too. Come on. <laughs> There's a new offer on the table. I love how they showed the title to the card twice. It's like, here's the yeah, cast again. You see what's on those hard drives. Families, got lives, lives got careers will be ruined. Sorry. Why are you in this alone? Where are the people you're protecting by not telling the whole story? I'll tell them everything they want to know about me. About me. That's it. It's her all game. Right. It's Molly's game. Even Pascal, uh, Pascal producing. Uh, yeah. All right. So, you know what? We always talk about a little superhero, not burnout, but we talk about that. We talk about we got your big tentpole franchises. Here is, based on a true story, but an original motion picture, Mark. This looks intriguing. It reminds me of Casino Royale a little bit, uh, mm, some yeah. of the parts, because it's got gambling. Sure. You like gambling. I like gambling. Uh, it's got a great cast. Mm -hmm. And I, I actually didn't see a lot of walking and talking. I or Bradley Whitford. I did not see walking and talking and Bradley Whitford. No 
nowhere to be seen. That we know of. That we know of. He could have been, he's so good, he could have been the poker chip. <laughs> he might have been the poker chip. He's method, that guy. He is. He can become a poker chip. Favorite ba Bradley Whitford role, say it. Uh, what, on count of three. Three, two, one. Young Guns out. 2. No? The lawyer in Young Guns 2? That's the best part. Uh, that's the best I part forgot. of his career. I forgot he was uh, in that. All right. He's but good in that movie, though. Molly's Game, November 22nd. That's kind of a, it's a holiday release. Holiday release. Not Oscar time. No, no, no. This is Oscars. You think it's Oscars? Yeah, I mean, this I know is that's Oscars. kind of that Oscar time frame, but I just doesn't. It can be Oscar. I mean, look, it's, it's like, like that smoky cool vibe. Aaron, I get that. Aaron Sorkin once wrote down an idea for a movie on a napkin and got nominated for an Oscar. That's how good this that's guy true. is. That's true. I forget okay? he's got that pedigree. So he's got this pedigree that, at the very least, the very least, if this movie comes off, and I love this trailer, actually. I know it's we good. were kind of riffing no, and having fun. No, it's good. Fun. I like this trailer. It's really good. It, it pops. This. It pops. It, it's got, it looks like it has great performances. Jessica Chastain is just, I mean, come on. She's the, one She's of the great. best in the best. She's business. great. So I think that if we get a hell of a movie, a la, mm, what? I got I got shades of Scorsese in here too. Yeah, a little so like Goodfellas or, or Casino or or what have you like this? Amer a good American Hustle. Um, a good American Hustle. I didn't like American. I didn't Hustle. like American. That Hustle was not either. a good movie. No, uh, but that was nominated. Yeah, well, that was nominated. If, uh, so. You're right. You're right. I stand corrected. That can get nominated. And look, if you like American Hustle, I like American Hustle. But I can see this. It's got power. J Jessica Chastain. She's got some power. She's got some power. We got Idris Elba. He got power. I think that this is a if if it. Everything goes the way it goes with Aaron Sorkin. Like I said, like Steve Jobs, Social Network, Few Good Men. He's written all these movies. He's nominated for all these movies. And then he transfer it. It's his first gig directing. If uh, we get a hell of a movie, we're going to see some Oscar love uh, come nomination time in, uh, in what, February? Well, yeah, Maybe? absolutely. There you go. There you have it. Thor in theaters November 4th. <laughs> and Molly's Game in theaters November 22nd. <laughs> That's it. That's Mark Riley. You can follow him at Riley Around. Me at Ken Napsuck. Tell us how much you hate us. And Mark, <laughs> yeah, check your email. See you guys next time on Collider Video. Hey guys, if you like this video, click the thumbs up button. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. It'll help you stay up to date with everything we've got going on here at Collider.